ton of sunshine to start today, although you see some in the background as the sun starts to come up on this Friday back to the mid 60s. Winds are calm. The winds are going to be on the calmer side today. Breezy at times, but certainly not as gusty as what we've seen really for the past few days. Live look in Blacksburg again with our Virginia Tech sky cam. Dew point still up there. So while it's going to be a cooler day, relatively speaking, still talking about that humidity cranked up for the next couple of days. 68 in Lynchburg, 65 for us in South Boston, 70 in Roanoke and at Smith Mountain Lake. We are back to the upper 50s in Hot Springs. One of the cooler days we've seen in quite some time. Talking about upper 70s for some in the New River Valley. Low to mid 80s along into the east of the Blue Ridge today. We're going to fall back into the low to mid 60s overnight. So this is the start of those changes. Going to put the end, though, to our heat wave this afternoon. So we're not going to tie the record for most ever 90 degree days in Roanoke. We're going to stop that at 8 think we'll be okay with that five. We had five 90 degree days last year and again the most 90 degree days in Roanoke in the month of May was nine uh, way way back quite dry as we go over the next couple of days. Really once we get into early next week again we're going to go from that uncomfortable category back to the comfy category as we turn Sunday into Monday. So that's when that big that noticeable cool down going to come our way. We'll likely have highs Monday and Tuesday in the 70s. A few scattered showers with us this morning. Most of that now pushing east of the Hill City. A couple of scattered showers in and around Horse Pasture coming into Martinsville. These are super, super light. Just good little sprinkles out there. But once we get to the afternoon, the opportunity for some bigger storms going to be there. There's 11 o'clock this morning. You see a few scattered showers to our west. And then the coverage going to start to, to grow the deeper we get into the afternoon, you see we've got thunderstorms everywhere. Some of those could be on the stronger side late this afternoon, early this evening. Most of that winds down prior to midnight tonight. There's six, seven o'clock tomorrow morning. So we're getting out to early for breakfast. I think most of us are going to be on the drier side. Just a few popcorn style showers and storms bubbling up tomorrow. Most of us, though, I do think are going to be on the drier side. Temperatures in the mid 80s today really through early Next week, 86 degrees with a few scattered storms on Sunday. That's with that cold front coming in. Look what happens behind it, though. Mid to upper 70s on Monday and Tuesday. Some of us guys, the time we wake up on Tuesday, could be in the upper 40s.